Hey guys, um, you read the title. Uh, I've been debating on how to let the world know the crazy neighbor passed away last week. Glenn is his real name. Um, he was surrounded by his family. Uh, had a brief illness for a couple of months. I've been out. Um, back from the coast to visit him. I'm, I'm back out on the coast now. But, uh, so, he was my real neighbor. He was right across the back alley from me. And the reason he's known as Crazy Neighbor, um, I was filming videos and I wanted him to be in a video, wanted the company on one of the trips. And uh, I said, well, you want me to call you Glenn? And he says, no. Uh, I said, what do you want to be called? And he says, mm, crazy neighbor. And so that's, that, that's where the name came from. And that's how we ended up in the videos. And, you know, he is a little more crazy on camera. As soon as the camera went on, uh, he, he loved the camera. He'd get up in front of the camera and uh, he loved to, uh, loved to entertain people. He uh, was a big part of my channel. Um, a lot of times, a video would not be nearly as good. Like the river trips, those were our favorite to do. Sadly, over the last couple of years, um, the timing didn't quite work to continue our river trip. Uh, we, we did plan to do the one uh, a couple summers ago. Um, and then we planned to do one last summer as well, but then my mom was sick. So, um, he was a great man, best friend I've ever had in my life. Um, a solid guy, so knowledgeable uh, about everything, always willing to help. Like it, he, he was just as good in real life as he came across on camera. So, uh, we're all, we all have heavy hearts right now. Um, and I know that he wants me to continue filming videos. And I know this has uh, been a rough little while uh, with, with a lot of things happening that are kind of beyond my control. And, but this isn't about me. This is about uh, a tribute to Glenn. Uh, he's riding his Harley in the sky right now. And um, uh, his family is, um, they're, they're really great people. And I, I'm still good friends with their family, uh, with, with, with Glenn's kids and all of, all of his friends. Like the, uh, sorry, somebody's mowing their lawn here. I didn't have a really good spot to film this. I've been putting off trying to film this video because I didn't, didn't know what to say. So I'm just winging it here. But uh, I I don't know what to say, guys. I, I know Glenn did say that, you know, keep filming the video, Steve. And from now on, it's an adventure. I have to continue on this adventure for the both of us. Because um, life, is, life is for living. And I'm absolutely privileged to have known him. And... Um, I'm, I'm grateful that he was able to have an adventurous last four or five years um, traveling around. It's like he, he was really living, um, living his dream, doing what he wanted to, going where he wanted to, hanging out who he, with who he wanted to. That was what he said about retirement was so great. And he had a great few years and was able to share uh, his joy and his joy and zest for life with the world and his legacy will continue immortalized on YouTube. Um, so that's pretty much all I have to say. Um, I'm not quitting YouTube. Uh, I'll be back, but obviously a situation like that comes before filming videos and there's no possible way that a, 
it would be absolutely inappropriate uh, over the last couple of months for me to be out having a great time and, or pretending to have a great time knowing what's what's going on with, uh, with Glenn. So that's all I could say at this point and I'm moving forward. Uh, I, I'm moving forward and we are going to be, we're going to be okay. Everything's going to be alright guys. Uh, stay tuned.